We'll talk about sticker shock. Water bills have been adding up over the last four months. The city is now sending out those bills, and the price could be four times the cost you expect. Rachel Carden explains why the huge increase is coming your way. Since the city's ransomware attack in May, customers have not been able to be billed for water. So now, all those charges from April, May, June, and July are being lumped into one price. The first 10,000 bills go out tonight. Have you noticed your bills have been a little less draining lately? I was thinking that's so weird. Why haven't we been getting a water bill? Since the ransomware attack on Baltimore City government starting May 6th of this year, water bills haven't been sent out. Water meters in Baltimore City and County were able to continue to read water consumption. However, due to the network out outage, D DPW was unable to process this data and produce water bills. But starting tonight, water, sewer, and stormwater fees from the last four months are being sent to Baltimore City and Baltimore County residents. It's how much the bill will cost. Uh, I guess that's a big thing. As the summer heat continues, families are starting to think maybe this bill will set them back. We got a pool in the back, so like a little baby pool, and that thing uses a lot of water. David Huber does what a lot of us do, pays his bills online. Many residents pay their bill in person at the city office so they don't get behind. But it might have slipped your mind without a bill coming to your mailbox. I'm not going to pay something I haven't seen. I got other bills I got to take care of, so out of sight, out of mind kind of thing. Marin you know? Francois owns a few properties, so whatever massive bill he gets has to be divvied up and passed along to his tenants. I have two buildings that like, I haven't been getting water bills for that I know is going to be hot, and I got to prepare for that. Once folks start to actually get these bills, they can pay them in person right here or mail them to this address. Of course, they can also pay them online or over the phone. City officials plan to work with customers by waiving late fees and putting them on a payment plan if needed. Bills begin going out tonight, but there are 200,000 customers here in Baltimore City and Baltimore County. A city officials say that everyone should have their bill by the end of the month. In downtown Baltimore, I'm Rachel Cardin for WJZ.